intro. Um, but I think an important thing to me, uh, the internet is a bit like Anakin Skywalker in the sense that I think it's fundamentally good, but it can be misused. And that's what we're going to hear about today. And I think a, a key for us is going to be what can we do with the academic and the scientific community to make a dent in the bad stuff that happens on the internet. There's a lot of what we're doing ourselves that the uh, sort of cybersecurity community is doing internationally. And I think by joining forces with researchers around the world, sharing data, analyzing that data, we can actually make a lot of progress in preventing bad stuff on the internet. With that, let's go quickly just to explain what ICANN is. And now, actually, just a quick show of hands. Does anyone know what ICANN is? Okay. Well, let's see. Let's see if um, maybe you have a different definition. So, uh, I, I describe ICANN. So, ICANN stands for the Internet Corporation for Assigned Names and Numbers. Um, when I speak to government officials, I describe it as an international organization. It is an international organization, except we work quite differently. We have a very practical and technical remit, which is basically to ensure that the, the way that endpoints of the internet communicate uh, flows smoothly. So it's, it's basically managing, coordinating uh, the domain name system and uh, internet addresses at a global level, working with the international community of businesses, governments, uh, techies, even end users and NGOs to make sure that we develop policies and ways of doing things around domain names um, that uh, but basically ensure that when you enter an address into your browser or when you're trying to send an email, it gets to the right web page, it gets to the right person, to the right endpoint that you're trying to con uh, connect to. And so a key mission for us as part of ensuring the stable and secure oper operation of what we, we nickname uh, very sexily the Internet's unique identifier system, i.e. the domain name system, it's to maintain the security, stability, and resiliency of the domain name system. Um, making sure that basically, again, the basic underlying technical infrastructure of the Internet is robust enough that we will not have undue interruption in how uh, data packets are routed 